What's up guys, today we're going to be showing you how to speed up a cheap slash slow Android phone. So if you bought a cheap phone and it doesn't have the best specifications or whatever, even if you have a high-end phone, uh, they can still get slowed down also. So this is going to be showing you how to speed it up, uh, hopefully, and yeah, so let's get started. So one of the first things you want to do is go to the, the Google Play Store and download an app called Clean Master. Now this is totally free. You can get it for free. You don't have to pay anything unless you want to go to the premium version. So pretty much what this will do is a, it's a nice little application that will clean junk files, but we're not here for that. We're here for the memory boost. So it will boost RAM and it will clear uh, everything out of the RAM so you don't have to swipe. And it will also clear some other stuff that's running in the background. So we clear the RAM. You can see it cleared 172 megabytes of RAM. And it also has some other stuff like you can clean junk files and privacy and you can manage applications from this app. So it's a really cool app. I highly recommend it. It's really awesome. So next thing you're going to do is jump into settings. Scroll down to developer options. And you're going to scroll down. And you can change the animation. So we're going to change it to 0.5. And what that's going to do is it's going to make it feel much faster. So I'll show you right now. So you can see the animation's got significantly faster so another thing we're going to do in developer options is we're going to scroll down we're going to go to force GPU rendering so I know you're saying why am I forcing GPU rendering so basically what that is is when you're scrolling through the UI it'll use the GPU to actually uh, scroll through the UI so it'll use the graphics to scroll through the UI and I don't know why that crashed but it'll use that and uh, it should be much smoother experience so we're going to head back into developer options and we're going to scroll down to don't keep activity. So if you have a cheap phone with not a lot of RAM, this does have 1 gigabyte of RAM. So it does pretty good uh, with RAM, but you can keep don't keep activities. And that's basically the big problem with Android is the RAM sometimes, sometimes with people's phones. Or you could put it on a limit so we can have, say, one app running in the background or two apps running in the background or no apps. So I recommend, I don't usually do a lot of multitasking so I usually keep it off and that'll keep the RAM that'll keep this phone moving very very fast when it doesn't have anything to run in the background so I highly recommend that the next thing I recommend is a launcher a launcher will definitely make your phone faster so we're gonna go to Nova launcher It's one of my favorite ones so you can download and install this it is free in the app store right now there also are a lot of other ones like Apex launcher and all you have to do is go into Android and search for launches and you can find the one that works the fastest on your phone. I recommend Nova Launcher if you can run it. So that's pretty much it. Those are the most simple tips without having a jailbreak. I mean without having a root and installing the ROM and all that stuff. So that's pretty much it guys. Be sure to subscribe for more content and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.